Happy Monday, everybody. Welcome to another reaction for Supergirl. And a lot has gone down this week. Flexicon was this weekend, and I put together a little video of all the fun things that I did when I was at Flexicon. Oh, that's interesting. I wonder why that video isn't working. Oh yeah, because I wasn't fucking at Clexicon. Yes, I spent the entire weekend just covered in jealousy <laughs> towards everyone who went to Clexicon. I'm super, super bummed that I couldn't go, but now I know for sure that I'm gonna go next year. I'm already gathering up all the extra money that I have um, in order to be able to get to Clexicon next year. It looked like it was an amazing time. I'm super happy for all the all my fellow YouTubers who got to meet up. Um, sorry I couldn't join you, but it looked like a blast. I'm glad that something like Clexicon was such a success and that it exists at all. Super happy for everyone who went or was able to go. Um, but next year. Next year I will make my grand entrance dressed as none other than Lena Luther or someone else, I don't know. <laughs> I probably won't dress up. Before we get started, um, I am planning a Q&A video. So if you have any cues and you want some A's to them, please contact me on any of my social media, Twitter or Tumblr, Tumblr preferred, because that way I can keep track of the questions easier. But yeah, questions related to Supergirl, unrelated to Supergirl, related to my new show, Yumi Her, which reactions coming soon, TBD, when those will actually start. If you're not watching it, you should be watching it. It's a fucking fantastic show. Seriously, so, so good. And they're allowed to say the F word, unlike fucking Supergirl. And they're allowed to show mul multiple lesbian scenes in one episode and all that good shit. So get on that bandwagon if you haven't already. Um, but Q&A's, send me them. The only thing that I've seen about this episode this week is very, very little, but the only thing that I've seen is just Alex punching people in the face. It's the only thing I've seen. And in my mind, that equals a grade A success. I don't even have to watch the episode to know that it's gonna be awesome because just of what I've seen, it could literally only be the five minutes that I've seen in sneak peeks of Alex beating the shit out of people, and I would know the gist of the episode and what I'm actually gonna give a shit about. But for the sake of argument, and for the sake of all the haters who are gonna comment on this video later, why not just do the whole reaction so that they can get much, much more content to work with when they're spewing their hate in my general direction? So, uh, back by popular demand, I heard Lena was in this episode, so I'm gonna see, uh, gonna see this guy again. I did, in fact, do that on Photoshop, and it's on Tumblr now for anyone who wants it. Best scene of the whole episode. Kyler's gonna blow this shit up. The fuck? Good one, teenage daughter. Girl who plays teenage daughter number one on this episode of Supergirl. The car. Oh my god, run, chick, run. God, this is some real shit right here. This is some real shit. No wonder Alex is punching. Oh, Terry Hatcher's in this one. All right. It's not enough to just let Sweet. He just makes the case worse and worse for himself every episode. I saw someone on Twitter comment on his hair this episode. This fucking guy is just trying to come to work, drink his coffee, and he's got this little, little blonde puppy jumping around his legs and like biting at his heels all the time. I kind of feel for him, honestly. I love Kara, but he's just like, I just want to go to work and go home. Bar times.
We already had an episode called Crossfire. We're done with that. Where's the kiss, guys? Come on. There's no way I'm giving you a grenade. Fine, I'll go get us another round. Okay, I'll rack. I'll rack. And why I loved the movie version of Dune, as I expected, except for... Oh my god, they're all there when this shit goes down. Except for Kara. <laughs> this chick is me. I am here for it. I am here for it. I really like her. I like this edition, honestly. This, this is whole, like, very symbolic. The whole, like, interracial. Whoa. Fuck. That is some serious motherfucking- oh, here we go. Pool cue. Incredible. Damn, she got some moves. Got some skills, Maggie. She's got some real moves. Alex is fighting in literally an old navy sweater. Her new gun, her favorite gun. <laughs> yep. Oh my god. That was so cute. That little standoff, that was so precious. Oh shit. The stakes have been raised. Why isn't Maggie there? She was a part of the whole attack. He is so annoying. Just fucking let them have the moment that they were having. Why do you have to interject? Oh, here it comes, guys. Here it comes, and I am fucking turned on. Get <laughs> just a good crotch kick. Fuck. That. Shit. Hank is implying that Alex can kill a man with her bare hands, and I believe it. Maggie better be the one to bring her back down from this ledge because if it's not her, I'm gonna be very upset. <sighs> Always be power posing. These people are so fucking oblivious. How how you sit that close to a person and not realize that that's Kara? Bitch, cape flip. She looks like strawberry shortcake right now. The half truth, a half truth is a whole lie. That is really a good quote. Big fan. Where's my Sanders? I feel it coming. I feel it in my bones, people. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Now this is the Jeremiah scene. It's fine. No apprehends me. They're gonna treat me as a hostile. You don't know what they're doing to me. Why is he doing this to her? Look at how conflicted she is. Will you help me or not? That sucks, man. She's gonna say yes, obviously. You just got wrecked. You were testing me. I had no choice. <laughs> You're a federal agent, Alex. We're talking off. Oh, oh, that's so awkward. <gasps> oh my word. My sadly I suspended. Oh no 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 no. Sean. Don't do this. 
Wow, holy guacamole kids. That is how you make a puppy fucking sad. Oh, where's Lena? Do I need to prep the missile? No? Yes? No? Yes? No. No. Uh oh. That is not good. That is not good. That is not good. Jeez, this is really epically disturbing. Oh my word. Hey Maggie, I heard what happened. John should have what happened. You you lost. She's gonna go at Kara. She's gonna start going off. What what matters is our father Shit. I assume you agree with Kara. Actually I don't. You wanna protect your dad this way you need to do. Then you'll help me. Ride or die. Oh, ride or die. Where do we start? Thank God, that's incredible. Excuse me. Lena, she said with surprise in her voice for some reason. Oh my God, do we were gonna go try that new fermentation place? I totally forgot. I'm, they I'm had so a sorry. date. There's just. There's she forgot about their date. Wife is not gonna be happy. Could be oh, okay. I should blogging about it. Yeah, you'd be right. I'll go snap her wood. How did you not think of that already? <laughs> Wow. Don't! There's so much lip biting, guys. It's pretty fucking obvious. The lip. Fuck. The lip biting, y'all. They did not come to fucking play around tonight. I can say that much. Is Maggie gonna crack some skulls? Here we go. Oh my god, tandem badassery. I cannot deal. <laughs> oh my god, they're teaming up, they're going up fucking rogue. I love it. I know what is. I'm gonna go with you. I gotta do it alone. Wish I had what you two have. Go away, Brian. <laughs> Amazing. Incredible. Absolutely fucking inspired. They're so cute, guys. I'm still kind of like, I'm high right now. That was adorable. Redirected. Consider it done. Is she gonna be redirected out a window where Kara will catch her? Is that the behind the scenes photo I saw? Why didn't you ask Maggie to go with you, though? I mean, I love this rogue Alex. I'm gonna shut up now. Hold your fire. Big what fan of this episode. Fire? Big, big fan. It's a ocean frigate to kill them all. You are forcibly deporting them. I mean, some of them have Relevant. Relevant, relevant, motherfucking relevant. No, no, everything you told me in the Lena's gonna come over to the I'm loving the lack of Monel in this episode. This is like the first slash second time we've seen him. Okay, well think fast the most moral person I know. So She's about to lose her fucking job, honestly. We are moments away, folks, from car dammers and losing her day job. And there it is. It's blocked. There you go. Where to block it? There it is. Oh fuck! Lena, stay back, Lena. I can't wait. She's gonna catch her. Jesus. 
Holy crap, guys. Ooh, got me all worked up. Got that bridal style carry, bitches. Someone told me last time in a comment that uh, they didn't do that bridal style carry the last time because Melissa couldn't lift her. And I was like, fucking they have, they make her fly. What do you mean? Bitch, yeah, you did. What a badass. I am very intrigued. I'm intrigued. What's gonna happen? Is he gonna punch Lillian in the face? There we go. Alright, we back. What a badass. Holy chemical warfare. You know he's gonna die. He's gonna die. Yep. Nice. That was really... I like it. I like the full speed running. How often do actors get to run at full speed for show? Or she's gonna get launched into space. <laughs> I think that's gonna happen. And then Cara and Alex, or Cara and Maggie have to team up to save her. And then they're gonna argue, and then Maggie's gonna be like, I love her. Very excited. What a hero. Oh, bye Alex, you're off into space now. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> she's going to space. Taking a field trip, bye honey. Puppy's going on an adventure. Oh, shit. <laughs> I am so impressed with this episode. Because there's no mon -El. Oh, see, what did I say? What did I say? Guys, this is an intense episode. My queens! Is this a scene everyone was talking about on Twitter? I think so. Oh, little puppy, use your biceps! Use them! Great acting in this scene. Incredible. I am blown away, motherfuckers. This is like me on a, under a big lift, man. Yep. This is like weightlifting. What a fucking hero. Incredible best scene of the whole season. Best scene of the whole season. Fired. What did I say? Lost your job. Yep. That's what happens, kids. Now you can't pay your bills, honey. Can't pay for your electric bill. Sorry. Gonna have to power your refrigerator with your heat vision now. Oof. Just a knife in the chest. Mm-mm. Poor little puppy. Please know why. I only did it to protect you. 
Daddy John. I never meant to hurt you. You sound just like him. Oh, puppy. Yep. Yay. Oh, big old hug. I'm so happy. Can we just agree to stop doing the little things for the right reason? Yeah, it sounds like a plan. I love Daddy John. Space Dad. I forgot he was still captured. That sucks. Yes, 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 yes. That was not nearly enough of a scene. That wasn't enough of a scene. And now we're gonna have Crapel. Here it is. Unless it's Lena, I'm out. <sighs> Time it. Time them. I'm not gonna stop doing this. Well, then you shouldn't have taken your man person's advice. I'm sorry, but you made a wrong call. Even though it was Lena's advice, but Lena had good advice. Time it. I should have actually timed it. Gotta watch. Ew, no, since when? Literally since never, like, we've never said that. I can only see her as the evil villain from Spy Kids, whose hair gets set on fire. You know, all in all, that was a very, very good episode, and I'm super stoked about everything that happened. Like, that, I think, is the amount of Carmel that should be in every episode, or the amount of Monel that should be in every episode. It should be equal, much less, let's just say, it should be much less than the amount of Alex and the amount of Kara. Can we all agree on that? Am I gonna get hate? Monel isn't a main character. Sorry, he's not. And Maggie isn't either. Okay, great. But he should always be less than Alex. That was a very Alex-centric episode, and I loved every minute of it. Let's just keep doing that, okay? God. I fucking love that shit. Mm. I'll see you guys maybe sooner than you think.